Well, I didn't think there'd be a day where I got three cats, but today is that day. So today we're going to get our kittens. We have everything ready for them in here. I know D Dylan already kind of showed you around, but um, we got the litter box ready. We're gonna put the litter box and the food in the crate, but we're gonna bring the crate with us in the car so the kittens can ride in there when we go pick them up. And the crate will kind of be our predator-proof little shelter for the kittens until they get older. And at which point we open up the gates and we just let them out and they can come and go whenever they please. Some say that we're supposed to leave them in here for three to four weeks so that they know that this is home. And when they go out and they're wandering around that they always know that this is where the food and water is and they don't try to run back home. But I've also read that if you have kittens, that's not so much of a thing that you worry about. So we're gonna kind of play that by, by ear a little bit. All right, so we are on our way to pick up our kitties with my niece, Michaela. Yay! Who's excited? All the baby chicks made their way out too. What do you think? You want to join them? No, you don't. Careful. Um, we got the cats and the birds out this morning just free ranging. It's my goal now as a farmer, if I can call myself a farmer, to get all of these chickens and well eventually the cats to just be able to free range without threat of the hawks or anything. And so I got this owl out here to try to scare off any of uh, the hawks. It didn't really work last time, but I'm just kind of out here observing. And that's the only time I'm gonna let them, especially the little chicks out and of course the cats. But as soon as I leave, I'll bring everybody back in. But yeah, just sitting here enjoying the day and it is absolutely beautiful. Thanks for watching today, guys. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe and we'll see you next time.